Hello everyone, my name is Natalia and today I'm going to show how to create the cutest pumpkin lights which are these ones here. You don't really need the top of them because that's where the candles are and if you want you can put some essential oil inside of them so they smell wonderful. I added some lemon scent so they smell amazing. So you can add any kind of scent you want to them like lavender or lemon or maybe chocolate. That's totally up to you. And even if you don't want to work with candle and candle wax, you can just hollow them out and then just put a tea light in it instead. So you don't work with burning hot wax. Even though the shell might be harder than the regular big sized pumpkin, they are very easy to make and they are super decorative. And you know, there are many, many different kinds of shapes and sizes and colors in these kind of tiny pumpkins. And I cannot wait to transform those to candles as well. So I have a whole table filled with these beautiful and lovely scented pumpkin candles. So if you wanna see some more of these kind of devices in the future, be sure to subscribe to this channel and give this a like. And if you wanna see how this is made, stick around and let's just get started. As I said in the beginning, the shell of these pumpkins are rather hard to get through, so place your cookie cutter where you want it, then take your hammer and start hammering it in place. It's rather difficult to hammer the whole cookie cutter into the pumpkin, so just take one side at a time, remove it with a plier and then repeat the process on the opposite side. And make sure that the shape of the cookie cutter is the same all the way around, so don't make any mistakes. Keep hammering the cookie cutter into the pumpkin until the tip is loose enough for you to just pull it off. You can use the shape of the cookie cutter to help you to remove the tip. Now remove the seeds from the lid with your knife and in the pumpkin with your teaspoon. Now you can save the pumpkin seeds if you want and create a delicious snack, but that's really up to you. Now take your candle wick and place it inside the pumpkin and if it's too long, just cut the excess off. Now take your candle wax and melt it and then gently pour it into the pumpkin. And be careful not to put too much in it because it might overflow. Now create as many of these pumpkins as you'd like. You can use some sticks to keep the wicks in place and centered. If you want, you can add a couple of droplets of insatial oil to make it smell nice, but do this while the candle wax is still hot. Leave them to set completely and that's it, your cute pumpkin candles are complete. So just light them up and enjoy. I hope you enjoyed watching and if you did, give this with a like, it helps me out a lot and let me know down below what you want to see next. And if you want to see the upcoming videos in this channel, you need to subscribe and be a part of our lovely DIY family here at the Bluetooth box. So subscribe and I'll see you soon with more ideas. Bye!